In this video, we will see how to VLOOKUP from one Google Sheet document to another. In other words, how to use VLOOKUP function to extract data from a different workbook. See, we have two different workbooks here. First one is Employee Details. The workbook called Employee Details has a single worksheet, which is Sheet 1. And Sheet 1 contains a table with the information of more than 50 employees of an organization. First column of the table has employee codes. Employee names are in the second column. Department in the third column, designation in the fourth column, salary in the fifth column, email address in the sixth column, and phone numbers in the seventh column. Second workbook is top performers. And here we have a list of employee codes corresponding to the top performing employees. Now about our requirement. Using these employee codes listed here, we have to extract the corresponding employee name, department, salary, and phone number from the workbook called employee details. Now let's see how to do that. To find the name of the employee corresponding to this employee code XNC558 equal VLOOKUP open parenthesis first argument of VLOOKUP function is search key employee code is the search key comma second argument range that is the range of cells where VLOOKUP function will search for a matching value of this employee code. In this case range or the table arrays in a different workbook the workbook called employee details and to we look up into a different workbook we have to use import range function import range open parenthesis first argument of import range function is spreadsheet url here we have to use the address of the first workbook that is the workbook called employee details to copy the address click on the address bar right click copy double quotes Paste the copied address here. Double quotes, comma. Second argument of import range function is range string. Here we have to use the name of the worksheet and the address of the cells containing data. Name of the worksheet is sheet 1 and address of the cells containing data is B32 H65. Double quotes. Sheet 1, exclamation mark, B3, colon, H65. Double quotes, close parenthesis, comma. Third argument of VLOOKUP function is index. Here we have to specify the column number of the column containing the data which we want to extract. Here we are looking for the name of the employee. And the employee names are in the second column of this table. Type in 2, comma. Fourth argument is sorted. False for an exact match. Close parenthesis. Enter. Right now the formula is returning reference error. Click on this button called allow access. And we have the name of the employee corresponding to this employee code. Let me change the employee code. We'll make it 560 and the employee name updated. With minor modifications in this formula, we can extract the department, salary and phone number. To lock the column of this reference B3, add a dollar sign before the column index B. Enter. We'll copy the formula into the cells on right side. We need department here. Say department is in the third column of this table. For department, replace 2 with 3. Next we need salary and phone number. Salary is in the fifth column and phone number is in the seventh column. Five. 7, for the details corresponding to the remaining employee codes, we will copy these formulas into the cells below.